This is Banjo and today I'm going over how to set up a camera to follow a unit. In the example we have a completed mission which already has a completed scene added to it. We'll simply be adding the commands to set up a following camera to the existing scene. The commands for the following camera rely on a named unit, so in this case I'll name one of the units R1. And I also added an event handler so that he will not take damage so he won't be killed during the cinematic. Next, going into the missions folder and finding the mission we're working on, we'll open up the init.sqf file, and this is where I'll be executing the command to start the scene from at the start of the mission. Open up the scene file containing the cinematic information, in this case scene.sqs, and set up your cinematic as desired all the way up to the follow cam. Start with the cam loop command, followed by the cam set target command, which will set the target we're following, in this case the unit named R1. Cam set relative position is the position relative to the unit, in this case 1.5 meters off the ground, 0.1 meters to the side, and 0.3 meters back. Cam commit is left at zero, and finally go to cam loop is added. Save the script, and close it. The cam loop command will loop the follow camera commands until broken. In this case to break it, we'll be using a second script called scene end, which our first command will destroy the current camera, being the following camera, and create a second camera, which will pan over the compound, completing the cinematic. I'll be using a trigger to detect when all independent forces have been eliminated from the area, at which case it will execute the scene.sqs file. Skipping through a portion of the cinematic I've prepared in the example mission, we'll be able to see the follow camera executed shortly. The mission and all scripts found within can be found in the link provided in the video description.